150 hopefuls came, performed, and tried out to be a member of this season's Paw Patrol. That's the Arizona Coyotes in-game entertainment team. Now, knowing how to skate was not a prerequisite, but as we found Ouch. out, it actually could help. today on the ice at the Ice Den Scottsdale looking to pick our team for next season and we're really excited. You know, I used to be a figure skater so it's like really fun to go back out on the ice and just do it in like a fun little like cheery way I guess. The Coyotes Paw Patrol part of their job description is pushing the shovels on the ice. It was kind of hard to actually like maneuver the shovel and stuff. I've never like had to use a shovel on the ice. And they're also in the stands throwing t-shirts, interacting with fans. <laughs> Although skating is not a requirement to make the team, it's an added plus. We're looking for people who are enthusiastic, who love the team, and who really just want to help make a difference in the community. Yeah, I love being involved with all of the fundraisers, events, everything that we do. We get to meet some amazing people, and it's just a great opportunity. Some people have been on the team before and some haven't, but everyone does have to re-audition. It's a variation of things that we've done in previous years, so we always get kept on our toes. We come from hockey backgrounds, figure skating backgrounds. Some people learn to skate just for this job. Everyone is always so excited when they find out they make it. Even if someone has done it for a few years, every year they still are so happy and so thankful for the opportunity to be a part of our team.